Hi, I'm Shay Rudolph, and you're watching Hollywire. Hi! Hi! I kind of want to play cast superlative. Um, okay, so who is the messiest? Um, I like genuinely don't think any of us are. All of us are super organized and clean, so. That's so funny, Ramona said the same thing. She was like, oh no, none of us are messy. <laughs> Who's the most likely to do something to embarrass themselves? Probably me, to be honest. I don't know, I like, all of us kind of just like say random funny things that might be embarrassing, but me? Yeah. Who is most likely to crack a joke at a not so appropriate time? <laughs> I don't know about not so appropriate time, but definitely the one that cracks the most jokes is Malia, and she doesn't even realize it. She'll just say something, and she's being completely serious about it, and then we all start laughing, and she's like, why are you guys laughing? And we're like, because you're being funny, and she like doesn't realize how funny she is. Um, who is the best at keeping secrets? Okay, um, I kind of want to say all of us for this because we did have to keep the Babysitter's Club a secret for an entire year. Right. So, all of us? Who is the best dancer on set? Mama. Mama, she's a competitive dancer. Yeah, Malia and I also used to do ballet for a little while, but we stopped. Acting, but Mamona is still a very avid dancer, so I'd have to go with her. It's so cool that this is the Babysitters Club is a show, and you're you're like the star. It's so crazy. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, it's it's a really awesome show. I'm super proud to be a part of it. What has life been like since you started filming this show? You know, since it kind of like came into your life. Like, what has it been like? Um, it's started to feel actually real now that it's out because. We've had to keep it secret for pretty much an entire year since we got cast, so it, it still kind of felt like I was dreaming while I was doing that because we were still kind of in a bubble of just us five girls and the rest of the cast are the only ones that knew about it. Oh my gosh, wait, so when you were filming the show, you couldn't tell any of your friends? No, none of my friends knew. Literally only my immediate family, so like my dad and my sister, of course they knew because I was going to a different country for a while. Um, so yeah, none of my friends knew. I had to keep it for a secret for a really long time. Um, very cool too. This is like such a girl power show. I mean, I, not even just the cast and the topics of the show and everything, but like it was written by females, co-written by females. <laughs> Eight yes. out of 10 episodes, right, were directed by a female. Yeah. Uh -huh. I mean, what, like tell me, what does girl power mean to you? Empowerment all across the board and lifting yourself and others up. And honestly, just not getting discouraged when somebody tries to knock you down, because sadly that happens a lot, I know. But I think it's really great that there are so many girls out there that have, that know their self-worth and are able to empower other people as well as themselves. Who are some of the females in Hollywood and the entertainment industry that really inspire you? Um, I really like Amanda Stenberg. I think she's super awesome. She's like the definition of girl power and being independent and strong. And also as far as like an acting career, I really like Elle Fanning. She's one of my favorite actresses. Oh my gosh, I'm so <laughs> glad you said that. I grew up with Dakota Fanning and let me tell you, I was obsessed with her because she just was so good. Like she was obviously so talented and amazing, yeah. but I mean, yeah, I think both of those sisters are so, such strong actors. And <laughs> did you watch the movie that Elle Fanning was in um, on Netflix? I did, yeah, okay. all the right places. All the, oh my gosh, that, is, <laughs> that was so good. Did you cry? I, d I was sobbing. It was like, I was sobbing almost as much as I did during Perks of Being a Wallflower, and that's saying a lot. And when you're not on set of the show or when you haven't been, like, what are things you're doing in your free time like that the fans maybe don't know about you? Oh, okay. Well, I've started recently sharing this like on my Instagram, just video clips, but I am very into music. I play the piano. I've been playing since I was seven and I just started the guitar earlier this year in January. So I do that pretty much every day. I practice those instruments. That's so cool. Do you think maybe you want to like kind of spiral off into the music world of the entertainment industry or uh, I I don't know. I've tried writing my own songs before and it's definitely really hard. So props to any songwriters out there. You guys are talented. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um I think for right now it's definitely more just something for like my mental health and just to keep me in check. Amazing. 
<laughs> Thank you so hey. much, Jay. I hope to see you Thank soon you. somewhere, you know, when the okay. gets back Have to Have a normal. good rest of your day. Thanks, you too. Bye. Bye, you guys. Thanks for watching.